Now speaking to Clan Cog 2B from Clan Analog. Hi, 2B. Hi. Elise. <laughs> Don't apologise for laughing. <laughs> Do I know you? Look, <laughs> the Clan CD, is, it's really good and you should buy it. No, no, don't buy it, don't buy it. It's really... Okay. <laughs> and, and, um, yeah, yeah, we've been around for quite a while, um, like three years, and, um... All right, all right. And, and, it's amazing, amazing how she asks the questions without speaking. I can read them up. It's, it's great. Um, oh, no, 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 no. We haven't done any... We have had some association with Opus. Uh, we've had, this CD's being released tomorrow. No, Thursday is the launch, but um, that's, today's 4th of July, hence my patriotic shirt or Barala's, and but this will be shown in August, and so if you can transfer time zones, you can come back to the launch on, at Punners Club oh on the 9th of um, something, July. July. And um, hmm. how, do, how are we different from Open to the Women's stop Collective? It. Stop <laughs> it! I can stop laughing. Okay. okay. You're crying now. That's right. It's very balanced. Very good. <laughs> Oh, I admire you. It's beautiful. Now, can you tell us a bit about Clan Analog and how it started? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> now? Now? Uh, how we started. Um, Clan Sydney started about four years ago, and they came down here a couple of years later to Melbourne, um, brought down by Global Warming, which is a nightclub in the city and ever since then we started up our own collective and Melbourne has now got a CD out which has taken about two years to come to fruition and we have contacts with Sydney and the other clan chapters around Australia by email and there's quite a strong um, internet element to Clan Analog, as there is with a few of the collectives, I understand. Fantastic, and can you, can you please tell us a bit about your own involvement in Clan Analog? Um, I am just a cog in Clan Analog. And what do you think about the collective approach within the music field? <laughs> yeah, um, okay. yeah, the collective approach. We, um, <laughs> there wasn't very much of a collective to start off with because there's Generally speaking, only a couple of people, like in any collective, um, that do all the work and then it becomes a bit of a kind of um, dictatorship and what have you, as everybody who knows politics and uh, committees knows. And But now that the CD's come out, um, it is a lot more of a collective and there's a pretty good vibe and I think we're pretty much here to stay. I think it's... Uh, tactical response to corporate bullying because it gives people clout it, with the, it's not just the, the pooling of resources there's also getting the name out there every time a clan analog band plays a clan analog name becomes popularized and unfortunately um, marketing means a lot in electronic music um, it's also the visual side, and um, and also, like all the collectors, I guess, a community feeling which is happening as we go along. With the visuals, we've had quite a variety of visual artists, and it's getting to a point where visual artists are collaborating more with the musicians. And as you can see behind me, there's um, computer art, we're also not concentrating solely on computer art. There's uh, Super 8, 16 mil, overheads, whatever. It's all technology. If you are interested in finding out more about Plan Analog, please see the number on your screen. Or, 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 or click.